Oh, it's one of the biggest gripes and anxiety inducing things after ordering something online, especially during the holidays. It's when is my package going to get here? Right? Check exactly. it Check the all the time. Kyra 7's Jesse Jones reports on the major delays involving FedEx and one woman who thought she gave herself enough time. We'll start at the end of the story. Kimberly Ruiz's FedEx package did eventually arrive. It looks like it's been beat up. It looks like it's been sat on. <laughs> looks like it looks horrible. The coffee maker spent a month going from Texas to Everett. It was picked up by FedEx on November 12th, and it was for my husband's birthday on November 25th. Kimberly is one of a number of customers who are upset with FedEx's tardiness delivering packages. I posted something on Nextdoor app to see if anybody else was having the same issue, and within 24 hours, I had over 200 responses from people in the Everett area. A look at her paperwork shows the coffee maker was on a non-caffeinated road trip. It took eight days for the package to go 2,186 miles from Irving, Texas to Kent, Washington, six days for it to travel 86 miles from Kent to Burlington, and 17 days to go 39 miles from Burlington to Kimberly's home. Okay, at some point, if it's been there for two weeks, shouldn't that like raise a red flag that, geez, we need to get this package out the door? And they just said, no, it shows that we still have it and it's going to be there. In a statement, the company says FedEx continues to navigate operational challenges due to constrained labor markets, increased package volume, and the ongoing pandemic. We're accelerating our efforts to bolster capacity which includes a laser-like focus on people, facilities, and technology. What do you think of FedEx and its promises? I can't swear, so. <laughs> <laughs> that bad? That bad, yes, that bad. So I responded to FedEx asking for more information to help consumers. What did I get in return? It makes no sense. I know, it doesn't. Their business model is just not getting packages delivered to people on the delivery end of it. Finally, let's see if the present survived. It's all just wet and damp. Yeah. You feel that. It feels like wet. Mm. But well, it looks like it's alive. I think so. Yay. <laughs> My husband's going to be happy now. He finally gets his birthday present. And at the bottom of the box, there was one final offer. Free standard shipping. <laughs> Do you want any part of that? No, not at all. <laughs> and Everett, Jesse Jones, Cairo 7 News. Oh boy, Kimberly, we feel you. Now, if you have something you want Jesse to investigate, give him a call, 1-844-77-JESSE. You can also submit story ideas on jessejones.com. Well,